We've been asking you to share your thoughts on COVID in school across East Tennessee. Here's what you've told us from Blunt to Knox to Hamblin and districts in between. This is Jimmy Shabiel. Carol Coffey. Don Sims. Corey Clower. We asked you about returning to the classroom. She is very thrilled to be there this year in person. She loves her teacher and her classmate. You know, we were very excited to return. Then COVID-19 cases began rising. My daughter got the COVID. The next week, my son got it. The same week, my husband got it. At least 3,000 East Tennessee students have tested positive since the start of school. We're tore up. We don't know what to do. I'm going to pull my kids out of school and we will homeschool. I did last year and I'm going to do it this year. Parents left us messages of frustration and helplessness. So I have no choice but to send him to school every day, but he has a heart condition that could possibly be deadly if he faces COVID. How can we let them go to school without masks or any kind of contact tracing? They also reached out with suggestions and pleas to district leaders. Then we need to take steps, strong steps now. It'd be nice if they would reconsider for the sake and health of our children. No distance learning option. All kids should do virtual until this mess is over with. Children who are in the classroom should be wearing masks. That was Grace King reporting. We're committed to covering the ups and downs of this school year, and we'd love to hear from you. Leave us a voicemail at 865-407-0116 or send us an email to 10listens at WBIR.com.